Are you facing issues with time slots or experiencing confusion about appointment times in Amelia? Are you and your customers unclear on when an appointment is actually set to take place? Maybe you're seeing different times in the back end than what your customers booked. Don't worry, we're here to clarify. Amelia uses a combination of your WordPress time zone settings, an option within the plugin to display time slots in the customer's time zone, and checks the device's physical location to keep times accurate. With a few tips and settings, you'll have a smooth experience in no time. Let's dive in. As you were able to see in the intro, configuring your WordPress site is a prerequisite for Amelia to work correctly. So just click on settings and make sure that your WordPress time zone is defined as a city you're in, or if the city is not on the list, the city that is in your time zone. If you configure your time zone to be in UTC something format, it will always be, for example, UTC plus one. At the time when we recorded this video, the daylight savings time stopped in 2024. So Central European time is now one hour ahead of UTC. Once we save the changes, that will create a problem when booking appointments in the future when daylight savings time starts again. Let me show you an example. Daylight savings time in Europe starts on the last weekend of March. So we'll quickly check Connor Matthews working hours and we can see that he works from nine till five every day of the week. So now when we take a look at the front end of the booking website, we are able to book an appointment with Connor in the future. Since daylight savings time starts in 2025 in the last week of March, we'll skip ahead to April. A customer expands April 9th and they see 10 a.m. They continue to book this appointment. And they see a confirmation that says date April 9th, 2025, local time 10 a.m. However, in the back end, remember that we fixed the time zone to always be UTC plus one. This means that this appointment has been saved at 9 a.m. on April 9th, 2025. Just to show you that this is not a bug and it applies to the daylight savings time, we will book the same appointment with the same employee, but we'll do it in the last week of March. In March 2025, we will choose the 26th, where we can see that the first time slot is now at 9. So if we skip to April, for customer, it displays 10 because daylight savings time starts and Central European time moves one hour ahead. If we were to book this appointment at 9 a.m., that would be correct in Amelia as well. Here's the confirmation, March 26th, 2025, 9 a.m. If we check March 26th, we will see that Amelia stored it for 9 a.m. So what happens here is that the time zone UTC plus one is fixed in WordPress general settings and it never shifts when the daylight savings time starts. We know that not many businesses will have bookings six months ahead, but when daylight savings time nears, people will be booking appointments thinking they booked at 10 when in reality it's at nine. To fix this issue, simply change the time zone and select your city. In this case, we will use Belgrade, which is in the Central European time zone and save the changes. Just to avoid any confusion, we will also remove 
this appointment and book it again. Now, since the time zone has been properly configured, we will book the same appointment with the same employee and we'll skip ahead to 2025 and we'll book the same date. So April 9th, 2025, customer will be booking at 9 a.m., which is correct because the employee works from 9 till 5. And here's the confirmation, April 9th, 2025 at 9 a.m. In the back, when we refresh this page, we will see the same date and the same time. Amelia has a neat functionality where you can enable show booking slots in client time zone. This means that your clients will always be able to see the available appointments in their time zone. Example, if your WordPress website is configured in one time zone and the customer is booking from a time zone which is two hours behind, when they click on a date, they will see a different time than the time defined in the backend. This allows your customers to be on time in their country while you're on time in your country. The time slot you see in here, which would be 4 p.m. in Central European time, would be 10 a.m. in the Eastern time in the United States. If you're thinking about using VPN to fool Amelia, that's not really possible. You can Google what's my physical address and check out any of these websites. When you access this website, for example, allow them to use your precise location. They will locate your device's physical location, which doesn't have anything to do with VPN. In this case, you can see Belgrade, Serbia. However, when you check VPN's address, it says Germany, city Falkenstein. So if you want to test how Amelia operates in different time zones, the best option would be to simply configure a time zone that you're not in. In this case, we'll set New York. We'll again verify the employee's working hours, which in this case are from 9 to 5, and we'll start booking. Depending on how you customize the form in Amelia Customize, this, indicating your time zone, can be displayed. But even if you hit this, once the customer selects a date, they will see times in their time zone. Since the United States ends the daylight savings time on November 4th, we can see a five hour gap. But if we move to November 5th, we will see the six hour gap between Central European time and Eastern time in the United States. Another situation is that you have employees all around the globe. So in this case, Michael Jones will have a different time zone. In the meantime, we reverted the changes in WordPress settings and switched back to Belgrade. But we configured Michael Jones' time zone to be in New York. So when you're configuring working hours for Michael, these hours to apply to New York. On the front end, when booking an appointment with Michael, we will see available times in our time zone. So again, 9 a.m in New York should be 3 p.m. in Europe. And this is basically it. 3 p.m. on a Wednesday, November 6th, which corresponds to Michael's working hours. If we go back and select a different employee who operates in the same time zone as we are, as we were able to see before, the first time slot offered is at 9 a.m., which is when the employee starts his shift. And that's about it. We hope this helped clear some doubts about time zones and how they work in Amelia. But if you need any assistance, feel free to reach out to our support team. As always, while you're here, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and 
hit that bell icon so you're notified about all our upcoming videos. Until next time, take care guys.